I'm George Gardner from GA Precision. We're at the 2022 Gap Grind. It's a pro-am event held in Finger, Tennessee every year for the last 10 years. The PRS has kind of formed its own industry circle with products that were never available before. You've got a lot of military guys that shoot this as a training opportunity for them. Manufacturers come into these events to, to spy out possible little niches they can get into. We're now at what our, we consider our flagship facility in West Tennessee, right between Memphis and Nashville, and is the largest precision rifle match in the world. That discipline is made up of hunting type scenarios. It's made up of tactical type scenarios, and also what we call practical type scenarios. Impact! The competitive shooting sports are a big deal for us. There's a lot of folks at the factory that love to shoot in competitions, whether it be precision rifle series, um, NRL Hunter, uh, USPSA, three gun competitions, you name it. We're all enthusiasts and that helps drive us to continue to make cool new products because those are the things that we want to have at our disposal. Every team there's a pro and then there's an amateur and I fit into the amateur class and the collective community knowledge. You could turn to anybody that had more experience than you and they were so generous in teaching you and showing you new techniques. And so you could really think about getting on with it rather than wondering how to do it. People were filling you up with information and it was an amazing way of, of passing on and encouraging newcomers into the sport. Sometimes there's a barrier to entry for some folks where they don't want to start reloading or loading their own ammo. Well, you can come out here and do perfectly well, in fact, win matches with factory loaded ammo from Hornady. So Hornady factory ammo is held to the highest uh, standards. We do accuracy testing on the bullets, we do accuracy testing on the ammunition, we do pressure and velocity, we do push-pull, we do a bunch of different tests to make sure that the product we're sending out is of the highest quality. I mean, I have a six Creedmoor rifle that with factory ammo is in single digit SDs all the time. It's ridiculous. So when you've got ammo that can shoot like that, any error is going to be on the part of the shooter. And then another big advent that we've had recently has been the A-tip bullets. So that's an aluminum tip in our match bullets. Match bullets with tips are always going to be more consistent than a Botel hollow point bullet. The analogy is like trying to form a, a perfect tip uh, with tin foil around a soda can or something like that. You just, it's never going to be exactly the same. Whereas if you have a part that is either a molded part or a turned part like you have with an aluminum tip, it's always exactly the same. But you just can't achieve that with a traditional boat tail hollow point bullet. And the A tips are really a cut above everything else that's out there. Hit